Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So Microsoft have finally started rolling out the latest version of the Microsoft Edge web browser for desktop version 106, which according to their release schedule, they should have released last week, but nonetheless, better late than never. And they finally made version 106 available on the 3rd of October, which was late yesterday in my region. Now, once again, uh, in this version upgrade, uh, there are um, no visual upgrades or any visual redesigns to the actual browser. Um, and most of the changes, once again, are taking place behind the scenes and under the hood, so to speak. And um, we get two new feature updates. There's changes to policies. And then, of course, we get those all important security fixes that have been made available. Now, the first new feature was um, actually a feature that rolled out and was introduced in Microsoft Edge version 103 which was the Microsoft Defender Smart Screen Library for Edge. Now, um, this has been completely rewritten in version 106, um, which Microsoft says now will give you a more reliable web defense. So you can browse the web with a more reliable protection thanks to the rewritten Microsoft Defender a Smart Screen Library for Edge on Windows. So just take note that's only for Windows users. And that means now, um, that while browsing the internet now, you have better protection against malicious threats online. And then the second new feature is only for work account uh, users who are using Edge signed in with a work account, where they have increased uh, the maximum number of work results that display in the address bar from 2 to 4, which offers greater and better visibility. And then um, when it comes to policies, um, policy updates, there are three new policies. Two of those are for efficiency mode, and one of those is for the Internet Explorer mode tabs. And then they've also uh, deprecated two policies, and then they've, um, there are two policies that have also been obsoleted. And then over and above that, we get the all-important security fixes that have rolled out. And when we are addressing security vulnerabilities in the browser, it's always good to double check, as always, that the browser is up to date. And to do this, we just head to the menu in the top right, help and feedback about Microsoft Edge. And if you do use the browser and open and close the browser on a regular basis, um, the updates will take place automatically in the background. But if not, this process will force the update in the browser, and that's to version 106.0.1370.34. Now, there are a total of 10 security fixes that have rolled out in version 106. None of those are addressing and fixing Chromium vulnerabilities, which the browser is based on. Um, the Edge browser, as many of you will know, is based on the open source Chromium platform. So out of the 10 vulnerabilities, none are fixing issues in the Chromium platform. And then one of those is an Edge-specific uh, uh, um, security fix for the actual Edge browser, which fixes a spoofing vulnerability, which has a moderate um, severity rating. So 10 security fixes, none for the Chromium platform, have rolled out and one for the actual browser. Now, I did post a video a couple of days ago where um, Google had rolled out um, three security fixes for the Chrome web browser, which um, addressed high risk vulnerabilities. And I see that these latest security fixes to the Edge browser um, um, do not include those security fixes. So I think we can expect to see those um, Chromium um, high risk vulnerability fixes roll out over the next couple of days as they haven't been included in this update. And if you are interested, um, version 107, which will be the next um, stable release, um, will be rolling out on the 27th of October. So that's uh, in the last week of this month. And um, that's version 107 rolling out on the 27th of October. So that's more or less what is new for this latest release now, version 106 of the Edge web browser for desktop. So thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one.